welcome back to a new, new video, video of Giris Chandra Vlogs. Alright, in the last video we had discussed about COVID-19. So we would like to express our sincere gratitude to those friends who have dedicated their precious time for us. Okay Gitu, what's your today's plan? My today's topic is ECG. Could you please guess the topic which is taking today? ECG? Yes. It's a vast topic. Of course. It includes ECG interpretation, BFib, BTAG, AFib, AV blocks. In that itself, so many classifications. Yes, but my topic is more important. Uh, it's a shockable rhythm. Could you guess it? Oh, VTAC? BFib? Yes. My today's topic is VTAC. So let's watch the video for the easy understanding. Okay, let's move on to the video. Ventricular tachycardia. Have you seen the faster rhythm? This is VTAC. As you know that the heart has one main pacemaker and a backup pacemaker. In this case, the main pacemaker SA node and the backup pacemaker AV node has lost control. So the ventricle will assume the role of pacing the heart. But it is not so effective that it could not pump the blood out of the heart. So there is no cardiac out output. As a result, there is no oxygen and the patient going to be dead soon. So let's begin with the definition of VTAC, a very fast heart rhythm that begins in the ventricles when both the SA node and the AV node fails to generate an impulse, the ventricles will assume the role of pacing the heart. There is simple 5 step to interpret the ECG of VTAC, first one, the rate 150 to 200 beats per minute. And the second point, the rhythm, what it could be. It is regularly spaced and even like tombstones. Look at this, the RR interval is regular here. And the third one is the P wave, none, because there is no atrial contraction. And the fourth one is PR interval, none. There is no P wave and there is no PR interval. And the QRS complex, that's the fifth one, it is white and even. This is the biggest landmark of VTAC. So hope you all understood about this. This is very simple and very easy to understand. So the next causes. What could be the causes of VTAC? First one, stimulants or stress like caffeine, methamphetamines. And the second one is medication toxicity like digitalis toxicity or digoxin toxicity. And the third one is electrolyte imbalances. Especially the low magnesium and the low potassium can also cause the VTAC. So you should be very careful about this. And the fourth one is cardiac injury like EMI or heart attack can also cause VTAC. How we can remember the signs and symptoms? Look at the patient, he is collapsed and rushed to the ICU. Remember the word collapsed. C for chest pain, O for oxygen, that is low levels of SpO2 and L for lethargy, that is muscle weakness, A for anxiety and P for palpitations. S for shortness of breath, E for elevated ventricular rate, the heart rate is higher sight and D for dizziness or syncope fainting. Remember this collapsed word in your mind. This is very easy for you to remember the signs and symptoms of VTAC. So remember the word collapsed. So let's discuss about the treatment in detail. The first and foremost thing that we need to remember is to assess the patient. This is the first thing you need to remember. And the second one, if patient has a pulse, Give amiodarone. This is to stabilize the rhythm. And then you can give a cardioversion. That is 50 joules to 200 joules. This is a baby shock. And mainly given to reset the SA nod. This is the first and foremost treatment if patient has pulse. And if no pulse, we can defibrillate the patient about 200 to 300 joules of electricity. And we can give a lidocaine. This is to relax the ventricle and amiodarone. This is to stabilize the rhythm and finally the normal cardiac arrest procedures to be full out. Thank you so much for watching. If you are watching the video for the first time, please
please subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for the notifications so that you will get all the notifications of upcoming videos. This is one of the recommended video for our subscriber. If you want to learn any topics, please mention that in the comment box. So let's meet again in another video. Until then, it's bye from Gidu Chandra.